Welcome to Subtraction with Money. You have 89 cents and you have to figure out what kind of coins you have to make up 89 cents. So, say you have three quarters, that would be 75 cents. So you subtract the 75 cents. So, 9 minus 5 is 4 and 8 minus 7 is 1. So you have 14 cents left. So you can either use two nickels or one dime. So say you just either or, two nickels or one dime. So let's count that down. Three quarters. Let's say two nickels. Two nickels is 10 cents. Bring down the four. So you have four cents left, so you can have nothing left but four pennies. So you can make 89 cents by having three quarters, two nickels, four pennies, or let's say you can either convert this to one dime, or you can convert this to seven dimes and one nickel. So altogether you can have eight dimes, one nickel, and four pennies another option if you didn't have any quarters. Let's go to a different example. 93 cents. So you have the 93 cents and say you had to use all nickels. All you had was nickels and pennies. So how many nickels make up 90 cents? So you know 5 and 5 is 10 so thinking critically, if you had, if you wanted to have 90, that would be 9 tens, so that would be 9 dimes, and you'd times that by 2, 18. So, 18 nickels would make up 90 cents. Bring down three. And all you have left is three pennies. So 18 nickels and three pennies. Or you can do nine dimes and three pennies. Or say you had some quarters, 75 cents. You have to carry over, make that an eight, 13. That's 8, and 8 minus 7 is 18. So you have 18 cents left. So you can use one dime, so it's 3 quarters. So one dime is 10 cents. And then, let's bring this up here. So you have one dime. And you subtract 5 cents is 3, 1 nickel, and then 3 pennies remaining. There is another option. 26 cents. So you have 26 cents and you can have 1 quarter. and one penny. You can have two dimes, which is 20 cents, one nickel, and one penny. So that's two dimes, one nickel, and one penny. Or Five times five is twenty-five, so five nickels and one penny. So many possibilities. Let's try another one. Sixty-eight cents. Say you want to use as little coins as you possibly can. So you'd use your quarters first, or if you have a half dollar, you can use a half dollar. So let's say you have one half dollar, one HD. 
that's 50 cents. Eight minus zero is eight, and six minus five is one. And you have 18 cents left, so you can do one dime, just 10 cents. One nickel, oops, that's not a plus sign. One nickel. And one penny. So you have 32 cents. Can't use a half dollar, so you have to use a quarter. Borrow one from the three, make it a two. Make that 12, and that's seven. Two minus two is zero, so that's one quarter. And you have one nickel. and then two pennies. And that's all I have with subtractions with money.